Today I'm going to show you how to tie a pre-tied snell rig. These are the type of rigs you would buy for blackfish, fluke, even striped bass. These rigs usually consist of a hook with a leader and a loop on the end for attaching to your main line. This is a great project you can do in the winter. You can tie a few hundred of these in front of the TV when you're bored once you get good at it. And it's pretty simple to do. I like to tie it with the hard monofilament pre-cut lengths that you can buy at a tackle shop. This line is good because it's easy to tie. It's very abrasion resistant and it's also pretty stiff so keeps your bait straight out without coiling up and tangling. So you see these a lot on the rigs from blackfish to fluke to even cod rigs. And you'll also need some hooks for snelling. These are some blackfish hooks, number three. First thing I like to do is cut down the leader material. And I cut these down to about 14 inches. I'm going to make 12 inch snells, so it gives me a couple of inches for tying knots. Then you want to tie a loop on the end. Okay, to tie these rigs, the first thing you need to do is tie a loop on the end of your leader. And that's pretty easy. Take the end of your leader, make a loop, make a loop in front of it, Take your tag end, put it in between the two loops you just created, take the loop from the front, and pull it through the back one. And there's your loop. Take your clippers, clip up your tag end, and you're all set. Now you have a piece of leader with a loop on the end and a free end on the other side. Then you take your hook, pass the leader through the eye, pull it all the way through until the loop meets up with the eye. Take the free end, make a loop over the hook. Now you can have this tag end, just pull the loop until the tag end is pretty close to the end of the hook. Now take this end of your, of your loop and wrap it over itself forward. One, two, three, four. Once you've wrapped it, grab that with your thumb and forefinger to hold it and start pulling the loop through the eye. As you pull forward, this might kink a little bit. You could just unkink it, pull forward, and then just pull it all the way through. Once it's pulled through, tighten the knot. I like to use my teeth. And there. Just pull it forward. And there's your snow rig. Just cut the tag end. And you're all set. Now you got a snelled rig with a loop on the end. And the beauty of doing this is if you tie multiple rigs and you're using the same length leader material all the rigs will be almost identical in length. In fact, if you're careful, you can tie 100 rigs and they'll all be pretty much identical in length. 